Okay, so this is the Delta Pro solar generator backup system that we have and how it hooks up to the house is we have 30 amp input go to a transfer switch and the transfer switch connects to the sub panel and that allows us to power certain circuits in the house so here we have five circuits that I've connected computer lights upstairs light downstairs the fridge stove microwave and we're gonna switch them on to generator here goes the fridge lights in the house lights and let's take a look at generator see what it got and we're pulling 147 watts right now input is zero all right we're gonna power up the computer station that right now is only running a couple of uh, routers and stuff so it's not drawing that much power all right and besides that I also have another input here and that goes up the gazebo and into the garage so here we are in the garage and that pipe runs down into the outlet that is connected so this is the fridge, the garage fish. I'm gonna connect it to the generator as well as the router and the cable modem. So that is running on generator right now. And we have 400 watts of solar panel as well as an extra 100 watt panel. But as you can see, we don't have any sun today so okay so with the fridge running and some lights inside the house we're pulling 350 watts just about um, and this unit can output 3600 watts so right now we're only using about 10% of its capacity obviously we'll need to replenish it with solar but that's the idea okay so we have some water in there we're gonna try to run it for a minute all right and it's shown that we're pulling 2,000 180 watts so the microwave pulls about 2,000 when it's running so as we, we can see obviously we have to manage the load so we don't exceed 3600 but this is a good test 